Good evening. The architect of Berkshire Hathaway, Warren Buffett honors Charlie Monger. The famed investor says two lieutenants will join him on stage in Omaha for the annual meeting in May by Karen Langley. Warren Buffett will remember Charlie Munger both as the architect of Berkshire Hathaway and as a cherished partner in his first annual letter to the shareholders since Munger's death. Buffett has long credited Munger, the Berkshire's vice chairman, who died November 28th at age 99, with shaping his thinking about investing in a preface to his letter Saturday, the famed investor described how Mongler recommended in 1965 that Buffett add wonderful business purchases at fair prices to the struggling textile business of which Buffett has taken control. Which much, much backsliding, I substantially followed his instructions, he said. Buffett, Berkshire's chairman and chief executive, wrote on a generosity with which Munger treated him. From its modest organs, Berkshire has grown to become the seventh largest U.S. company by market value. Charlie never sought to take credit for his role as creditor, but instead let me take the bows and receive the accolades, Buffett wrote. In a way, his relationship with me was part older brother, part loving father. Even when he knew he was right, he gave me the reins, and when I blundered, he never, never remind me of my mistakes. The title, Charlie Munger, the architect of Berkshire Hathaway, typed in an ornate font top the tribute page. Buffett, who is 93, ended his letter offering shareholders an invitation to Omaha, Nebraska for Berkshire's annual meeting, where he said Greg Abel and anti Jane will join him on stage. The event, which he has called Woodstock for capitalists, is set for May 4th. Abel and Jane respectively lead Berkshire's non insurance and insurance businesses. Berkshire also releases results for 2023, reporting a profit of $96.2 billion.